Karam up front, Hedrick and Kudla on the back line. Grizzlies push it back out through center ice. Steelheads quickly back into the attacking end. Domowski right circle. Rebound! They score! Ty Pelton Bice cashes in on the rebound. Tonight, it took just 49 seconds. Idaho out in front, 1-0. Well, Willie Neerham down the right wing found Demowski at the top of the right circle, and Demowski a long range shot with Miner making the initial save. Pelton Bice got behind the defense in that left circle and able to fire and pass Miner. Steelheads out in front, 1 0 for a uh, second of the postseason from Pelton Bice. Play Martell from the top of the right circle. His shot deflected wide. Martell gets it back, tipped in front, they score. Jordan Martell from the top of the right circle, threw it at Adam Scheel, and Kyle Betts deflects it past the Idaho goaltender, and a Utah power play goal ties things up at one with 17.24 to go in the first. But it's a 1-1 game here, four and a half into the opening frame. Game number four of the Mountain Division semifinals from the Maverick Center in West Valley City, Utah, as Idaho looks to even the series at two games apiece. Back behind the net, a shield, bouncing puck in front, and they score. Zach Sekos in his return to the lineup for the first time in a month. Makes it 2-1 Grizzly with 15-21 to go in the first period. Offs it up, and Richie on a partial breakaway. Demelski back, Richie fires up the... They look to take a two-goal lead. Kyle Betts, who scored that power play goal, takes the face off. Utah will control. Betts on the near half boards for Cameron Wright, firing, and he scores. Cameron Wright at the right, or left circle, beats Adam Shield near side. And Utah two for two on the man advantage. As Wright has his second of the series. Utah three, Idaho one, 6.44 to go in the first. Puck worked free behind the net of Adam Scheel. Kudla up the far boards. Kawaguchi zips it out through center. Not enough for an icing. Thomas back. Murphy works it free. Wade Murphy, left wing side from the left point for Kudla. Center of the line. Hedrick for White down front. They score! A.J. White with a tip in front through the five hole of Trent Miner. And the Steelheads are back within one as White has his first in the postseason. It's 3-2 Utah, 6-16 to go in the opening frame. What a response, Cam. Well, Cupper, that starts back in the defensive zone with Kawaguchi on the far wall, hoisting it out through center. Murphy hustling it down, forcing the turnover behind the net. Working it low to high, and a nice shot from Hedrick, and a beautiful tip in front from the captain. Yeah, that was awesome. Good to see. To the live in the offensive zone. Gumatsis activates from the left point, slides over the stick of Franklin. Here's a breakaway. Jamison on shield. Forehand shot. He scores. Idaho with a turnover at the offensive zone. Blue line. Jamison sprung on a breakaway and he risks one far side over the glove of Adam Scheel, his first of the postseason. And the Grizzlies take a 4 2 lead inside two minutes to play in the opening period. Remains 4 2 Utah. Game four here of the Mountain Division semifinals with the Grizzlies leading it 2 1. Here comes AJ White down the right wing. Kawaguchi to the left. White finds him. Kawaguchi fires. He scores! Jordan Kawaguchi pulls Idaho back within one on a beautiful setup from AJ White. It's 4 3 Utah. 14 32 to go in the second. Get to talk about Jordan Kawaguchi scoring goals against the Grizzlies. And uh, what do you see there, Cam Fire? I'm a man of my words, Jake Kupski. I like to see it. Kawaguchi beats Miner near side. Kawaguchi, who was unavailable for games one and two last week in Boise, gets his first point in the playoffs. Just like that, Steelheads are back within one. Now fires, it went off with a skate of White. No corral now behind the net. As McDonald and White go to battle. Kawaguchi works it free. Murphy left circle. Ducharme right circle. Wrist shot blocked down in front. White finds it. He scores! A.J. White! His second of the game. It comes on the power play. Out in front.
in front. Steelheads tie it. 4-4. 841 to go in the second. Like I said, Cam McGuire, number 18, good player. Who has a goal and two assists. White wins the drawback. Center point, Barteau. Left side of the line, Kawaguchi. Down low, Murphy fires. He scores! Wade Murphy gives the Steelheads a 5-4 lead. It comes on the power play with 16.41 to go in regulation. Barteau at the center of the point. Left point for Kawaguchi. Down below the left circle. Murphy took a couple steps in and roofed it. Upstairs on Miner. Wade Murphy with goals in back-to-back -back games. And Idaho has taken the lead for the second time tonight. Bets falling on the dot. Right scoops it up. Mayhew from the left point. Fires. He scores. sure if there was a deflection in front, but Kyle Mayhew from the left point fires a wrist shot towards Adam Scheel and ties things up at five with 11.02 to go in regulation. I think that one maybe up over the near shoulder cover. That's what it looks like, yeah. Near circle, gets it back, and he rolled it just wide. Hedrick right point, looks towards the net, fires, tipped, they score, they score, they score! Ty Pelton buys in overtime, and the Steelheads Damn, take I gotta Game go. Four by a final score of six to five. Ty Pelton buys a deflection in front, and this series is tied up at two. Game five tomorrow night, right here in Utah.